uh, really star products of the day. Of the day of the day, <laughs> and they're best sellers, and you don't want to miss out on this. Mark Charles, this is really a five and one. This is going to replace five tools in your kitchen. Five tools in one, but do it safer, faster, and easier. The whole idea is that Kuderi kind of came up with an idea to actually uncrimp the can or reverse the canning process. So when you see a can like this that I actually just opened with this can opener, you don't see an ounce of any food on there. You, that doesn't look open, but what you're going to do is the little bird beak, see that little guy right there? A little button I push. You're going to take the end, and I've opened this can, with no sharp edges on the can or the lid, and now I'm able to actually put this into the garbage with no tears or rips through the garbage, no hurting yourself with any sharp edges, and you get into the can. So if that wasn't worth the price of admission, we gave you four of the features on it. If you flip this can opener around, we put four of the features on the end of that can opener. And the first thing you're gonna notice is the parrot beak. That's because 60 to 70 percent of the cans are pull tabs or ring tabs, or whatever, right. whatever the term is for a lot of people use. You can go underneath here, you can t curl this forward, and what happens is that your hands are now not gonna get cut because my hands are free from the sharp edge. So we can't stop the sharp edge from the pull tabs, but we can keep our hands away safely. So that's what that does. And then the next feature is this church key skeleton key that's stainless steel. It's gonna open up any bottles at the top there. Then if you flip this around, there's a graduated ring in here that one liter, two liter, and three liter bottles, soda bottle lids are all the same size. So the little tip here is just twist the bottle with your fingers, keep this in place, and it actually is going to break that seal with your fingertips that easily, so any pressure that's And maybe you in. said this, Mark Charles, the yep. size lid is the same for a one, two, two or three, three liter yep. bottle. Yeah. So we made it a universal on there. And then the last but not least, you'll see this little hook right here. That little hook is for metal lidded jars. To get underneath, I'm gonna put this down here, you wanna make sure that hook is underneath and pull forward, just like that, and what you didn't hear, but I can promise you, is breaking of the vacuum that it happens in the canning process. Oh, those are banana peppers. They're my faves. Delicious. Sandwich. All right, now, let's talk to you about color choices. I have this for you in the, are we calling this one green? Well, lime? No? Mm, if it's look, not lime, that's green. Let's see. I think it's green. Green. Green, coral, sage. Sage, yep. Okay. Yep. Then I've got it for you in gray. Then the aqua, then black, which is the color I have in my kitchen, and then the red. So let me do that again. Red, black, aqua, gray, sage, coral, and we're calling this one green. It's lime it's all lime, day. It's lime, correct. But for ordering processes, call it green. And some of these colors are new. You haven't seen a coral before. You don't see white too often. I've been selling this can for 22 years. Where did years. white come from? Do we, don't we have white? Do we have not have white? Do we not have white? Did someone put this on there the There is no white. Sorry, the white's no gone. No white. White's gone. <laughs> It was there, and now it's not. I just do what's on, what's on the set for me, okay? So the plum is here, right? Um, is that not here, Peter? No, 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 no plum. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Is this here? Yes, it is. Okay, great. Let's do this one. Coral. Okay. I'll keep you posted if that changes. Yeah. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, so we're going to twist this. And again, what's unique about this is people are used to a can opener like this. You see this? The can opener like this has to open okay. up from the side. But let's also point something out. You yep. see all this yuck on here? We'll come in nice and tight on this. Yep. See all this yuck right here? You might think that's rust, and maybe some of it is. But you know what else that is? That's bacteria. Bacteria, correct. Because someone used this to open a dog food can. Yep. And then they used it to open green beans. And you know what happened? Some of those nasty bacteria dog food crumbs dropped in the green beans. Yep. And I promise you, no one cleans their can opener. I have to be honest with you, the only way to do this is a toothbrush and bleach every time you use your can opener. And how many of you at home clean happen. your uh, can opener with toothbrush and bleach Everybody after every raise use? your hands, because I don't think that, oh, come on, you don't brush, you, you clean with a brush and a tooth, I don't, no. <laughs> well, she does, but she's the only one, one in America. One, I'll give you yeah. one person. <laughs> but the whole idea of this can opener is that you will never have to do that, because here is, what is this? Cannelloni beans, and there's a lot of juice in there. I just want to point something out. There is not a drop of beans. There's not a drop of sauce. There's literally nothing. So I can do dog food, right to baby formula, or you know, milk, evaporated milk, green beans, right to a casserole. It doesn't matter because nothing touches the food like a traditional can opener. Does. Mark Charles, let me say that a thousand of these are gone, and another one thousand people are waiting to place orders. We would encourage you to utilize QVC.com and your mobile apps as your two best and easiest ways to get through right now. These are going quickly, and mm, how good is chicken noodle soup? Oh, um, this it, no, it'll cure everything that ails you. This is fantastic. You can use it for your birch beer or for your soda cans, soda bottles. This is white wine vinegar. 
and that's capped the same way as soda can is. And notice it's a small one liter versus the two liter that I opened up earlier. And trust same you size. do not want to spill this vinegar because it is stinky. Oh no. But yeah. it does clean out a lot of stains off carpets and stuff. It also helps to descale coffee makers. Oh, look at that. I didn't even realize See that. There. Very nice. That's why when I'm at the store, I buy a big thing of white vinegar. Um, because it when you need it, you need it, right? Mm -hmm. All right, so let's go through color choices again as Mark Charles pulls another seal uh, or pressure seal off of what looks to be banana peppers. Yep, another one. This is green. This is coral. Coral is brand new. This is sage. Then I've got gray. Then the aqua, some might call that Carolina blue, I know I would. This is the black, the color I have in my kitchen. And here's the, um, the red. 1,500 of these are gone now. Hot picks are those star products of every day on QVC. And when they appear, you don't want to miss out on it. Are we going to ask some audience I members for help? We were. Do we have someone lined up? Who do we have? We're going to invite someone down to see if they know how to use said appliance. And if they don't, we will teach them because if they've never used it before, it's going to be a little different. And if they volunteer, I bet they're going to win a prize. Maybe they will. <laughs> All right. Uh, we're here. What's your name? My name is Lena. Hi, Lena. Hi. Thank you so much for volunteering. Let's come on and uh, open some cans. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, let's hear it for Lena, everyone. This is so sweet. Lena, 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 Lena. <laughs> Wow. Did All you right, Mommy. Boxing gloves on, Lena. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Come on in. Let, we'll let Mark Charles give you a tutorial and see if you okay. can make it happen. So, what I was explaining earlier was when you have a can opener, I'm sure you're used to, you're used to going from the side, right? Yes. So, this is an auto attach. You see the way you twist this and it catches on? So, all you're going to do is put it on top and let it catch. See if you can do that. Okay. The first time's a little weird, truly. All Just right. Put it, sit it right on top of the edge, like that, and okay. then twist until you feel that it catches the can. Ah, got now, it. Now, lift the can with your hand, right? <gasps> That's how you know you got it. Okay. Just so you know, and not all go right. around. Now, go all the way around. Put that can on the table. Yeah, make it Plus, easy for yourself. Don't put work. it all the way around. And, <laughs> and when the tension changes, you'll know you have completed you'll the feel circle. It. When it goes a little bit quicker for you and a little bit easier. Yep. D now reverse your. Okay, hand. now go Twist. counterclockwise. Keep going. Look at that. Now Let lift go. up. Okay. You opened it. But how are you going <laughs> to open that lid? Now, there's a little gray button right here. Okay. Tweedle -dee -dee. Okay, yeah. Try to grab the edge with that. Okay. There's a little bird beat. And don't go too hard. You don't have to just a little, a little touch this and pull up a little bit. There you go. Great job. Not bad. <laughs> no rehearsal. Not bad. Lena, 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 Lena. Lena. Now, Lena. Lena, Lena, Lena can contest this, but I want, you know, I want to be very clear with everybody. You've never opened a can like this until you've gotten this can. It's very different. Our whole lives, we're used to this can opener. So the first time is a little awkward, and I'm sure you experienced that, right? Yes. But I think this is one of those gadgets that once you get it, you get it, and then you always have it, right? Mm -hmm. I agree. Okay, good. Well, and yes. you're always going to have it, too. Do you like that red you're holding? I can. Or is there another color <laughs> you like? I want to make sure you like the color. Do you like the color? Oh, well, you know, I have my eye on the till. <laughs> oh, on the aqua. Oh, aqua, yes, yes. yes. Okay, this yeah. one's still available, but it's going home with Lena. All yeah, right. all right. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Lena. Enjoy. Oh, oh, doing yeah. a happy dance. I love it. I love it. Lena, Lena, <laughs> Lena. Good job, Lena. Thank you, Lena. Right, so can we find another aqua if there, yes. if one exists? Right. That'd be great. That's okay. perfect. That one's all yours, my friend. Okay. Enjoy. Thank You're you. so welcome. Good job, nice. you two. <laughs> All right, we are busy. How many are gone now, Brian? 2,500 are gone. I would not wait on this green, coral, or sage. These three are all going very, very quickly. Well, they're the newer of the family. They're the newer of the and family. And imagine that teal is here. Oh, it's coming. It's coming right there. We're going to get a replacement. Teal. It's really pretty teal. Because when we uh, pull any show house. at QVC, they pull two of every color. I bet you didn't know that. You do now. It's a little fact, right? Yeah, exactly. And so no matter what size the can, the even your little tomato paste opens it up. And what's really important, why I do the tomato paste, not only for the size, but guys, again, look at that. If you open this up with any other can opener, you would have tomato paste on those blades because they'd be touching the food. So this is a safer way. Not only are you keeping the can from being, and the lid, from being any sharpness. What if you're then not opening up the a food. can of baby food and it Correct. pureed peaches? Right after the tomato paste. Not a good Not a good thing a for good the baby. Mix. Not a good mix. Mm -hmm. not a good Baby's mix. not gonna like that. They're gonna and make a face, they're gonna spit it on let's you. Let's talk about the sharpness too, guys. We took a regular can opener, which was this one, just to remind you. We opened up this can. It was actually sharp enough to actually cut through this lemon. I just opened this one live for you, just to show you the difference, okay? I mean, I can't break the seal of that. That's the difference with having that 
smoothness or that rigid sharpness that is dangerous in your home. By the way, there are pet accidents, people accidents, ripping garbage bags because of these sharp edges. So it really helps out in the kitchen, not only making it easier, but making it a safer kitchen to open up cans. Now, I do want to remind you of the color choices. Now, how many are gone now, Brian? Almost 3,000 are gone now in this show. And I have another, um, how many people? Another 1,000 people on the phone lines. This is the green getting limited. This is the coral. Here is your sage. That's the most limited. This is gray. On QVC.com, we're going to show you the aqua. Okay. There's the aqua. Lena's got it. Lena has it in her hot little hand. <laughs> We should go live to Lena in the seat. <laughs> and, and Lena could wave it up Leave in the it. air. And don't forget the aqua. <laughs> and then we have it in the black, and we have it in the red. Lena, go ahead and hold, hold, hold up your... Hold up your... Up. We've got to show the color. There's there the it aqua. is. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> See, and, if you come to a live show, we will give you free stuff. I know. <laughs> free stuff can be yours if you come to a live show. We also feed you, which is a good thing. That's a great thing. All right. So again, let's talk about the other four features. Here's the parrot beak. That's that curve right there for those pull tabs because why it goes underneath. Whether you have manicured nails or you bite your nails, I'm not going to talk about the fact that I do, but I do, and you can't grab underneath there, but my hands are free away from that sharp edge. Now, that's something we can't stop the can from doing, which is create a sharp edge from a pull tab because that's the way it's built. But being that my hand's away from that, I can open up that safely. So that's number two. And then number three is going to be this church key or the skeleton key. There's a lot of terms for it. But it's stainless. And why is it stainless? So now it's not going to chip, peel, or crack on you because it's going to stay sturdy inside, you know, opening up all these bottles over and over again. Here's another size bottle that I'm bringing out. A one liter bottle. One liter bottle. It fits on top because that's universal lid. Even personal water bottles are the same size lid. I know it's one of those trivia questions if you want to dazzle your friends at a party. They probably don't know this, but, you know, I learned this with the can opener that they all are a universal lid, which is why we made that, that cap um, on the edge of it. And the last thing, again, to remind you, for metal lidded jars, we want to break that vacuum. So what we do here is we put a little ledge here right there, and that ledge goes underneath, and you're just going to pull forward, and when you pull forward just like that, it's breaking that vacuum so I can open up just like that. Those right, are right? jalapeno pepper jalapeno. rings? Yes. Oh. Didn't know that was a thing. I didn't know what it was either. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey, let's talk to you about green. Here's the coral. Most limited is sage. I also have it in gray. Here it is in the black. In the red, and finally, we'll show you on .com, the aqua. Here comes the aqua. There it is, aqua. So aqua is also available. Don't miss out on these. Hot Picks are star products of every day on QVC. Very, very, very popular. 3,500 now ordered Ooh, in this show. Thank you, everybody. And before we run away, we probably should point out the beautiful lady in the chair on the floor. Because I understand, it's well, mom. it's Mitch, our, one of our food, food stylists. stylists my food chefs. stylist for the last 20 years, Mitch's mom right That's there. That's Mitch's mom. Hi there. What is her first name? What's your first name, ma'am? Your first name? Your first name? Elaine. I just call her Mitch's mom. Well, <laughs> you could do that or we could call her Elaine. All right, Elaine, we're thrilled to have you here and we love the work your son does. Yes, we love him. He's one of our prep chefs here at QBC and he does a great job. We're going to check in with our Steve, who's going to update us on what's happening in the show and give us a little update on today's special value. Ooh. You 